Hello everybody and welcome to a Farming Simulator 15 mod review with FS Panda Mushroom. Hello, we have for you today the Flegel DPW180 auto loading, or as he says, auto charging function version 2. So there you go, these are auto loaders. So I'll just go in the shop for you. And we go into bailing. And there they are, the flea called DPW180. It will cost you £12,000, £15 a day maintenance. And this bale, bale trailer collects bales, wool, wood, washed potatoes, tree saplings automatically, depending on the fill level. Fitting straps will be faded in and out. And then there's the DP150. What he's done is from version 1.1, version 1, um, he's added the DPW150 uh, at £9,000. It cost you at £5 a day maintenance. He's also added the DP W150 tandem at nine and a half thousand pound with five pound of maintenance a day. And the only difference between these two, it tells you there one has a silver attacher, one has a black attacher, and that also costs you nine and a half thousand pound with five pound a day maintenance. Right, the DPW180 was the original, uh, that's got um. Well, let's just go and have a look at them, basically. There you go. That's the 150 with the fifth wheel. That's the 150 with the black. This is the 180. And there's the 150 with the silver. You can't jump through them. It's based around the in-game DPW-180. So yeah, but they don't look much, but it is all in how they load. Just take the black, nicely. And what he's done, I will just put the hood back on for you. As you can see, it says press 5 to show for legal help. So you press 5, and there's all different options now. There's load product, uh, toggle load type, um, toggle product type, and five to hide flegal 150 help and then there's two so right load product type but at the moment as you can see it's straw square bales if you press x hay square bales square bales mixed straw round bales hay round bales grass round bales silage round bales round bales mixed wool pallets tree saplings, board pallets, potato pallet washed and ROS transport boxes. Okay, right what we do is we put it on uh, the transport boxes because it's not a problem but I have noticed a little thing. So we just go and we buy a few uh, trailer. Nope. How many we got? I think the small one. We got nine. The small one can take um sixteen. Yeah, and the big one twenty. Or it could be something different. 
same again you can it on it loads it from quite a distance so if you want to just press B see they were stacked between the trailers and you can see a lovely animation with straps and everything press B again and there you go all loaded very secure very good I'll leave that till the end to show you the problem with the ROS transport boxes. So let's tab. Here we have one with the pallets. And it's, according to him, if you if it's a full if it's an empty pallet, I'm sorry, not empty pallet, a half full pallet, then it won't do it because of the strapping. It can't work it out because of the strapping. So same again, you press 5, you can also choose between, at the moment, loading types manual, if we go to J, press J, it goes to automatic, and then you press B to start automatic. Right, we need to go and toggle down to wall pallets, wall pallets, there you go, press B and zoom. there you go. Also, there you go, you can also see there's something else that's come up now. Show on load help on 6. So if you press 6, you get a box. And where that box is, is where it's going to unload. So you can now toggle which side you can unload. So you press M. So that's the back that's the side, the uh, right side, that's on the actual trailer and that's the left side so we choose left side, press O there you go, easy as that. Once you go to a trigger if you if we was loading this to take to a trigger you have to actually unload it in the trigger let's just load it back up again and quickly run up to the trigger for you. Let's turn off six. So you can't just go and um, expect it to zip them off because it's still sort of locked down on the auto loading so unless you put it to unload on the trailer then it won't recognize it as a pallet of wool in the box but it's just as easy to unload it There you go. It doesn't take it. Then you just go unload. There you go. That's just earned me nine and a half thousand quid. So right, here we are in the field. Press five. What have we got? We got load uh, straw bales. Yep, no problem. We choose auto loading. So we press. Um, J, it's in load type, so we press it auto, start loading, press B. Magic, just pops in. Now then, what is also changed from version 1? There you go. Driving too fast, auto load stopped. So now you have to press B again. So if you go over 25 kilometers an hour, that's going to come up. auto loading stop so you have to press B every time so if you keep it around about 15 go over 15 then you have to press it again 
same if if I toggle to um, on load manually you come along a bit fast if you come along a bit fast you know 20 so you can't zip around it's going to tell me press B to load too fast as easy as that you can either auto load it or just press your finger on B it loads seed pallets as well stack some 3i on bales still going too fast takes five um, no sorry the DP the only difference between the 180 and the 150 is the length obviously the 180 can take 24 bales 30 round bales uh, 12 tree sapling pallets twelve wool pallets eight wood pallets so from Mahu if you've got the timber mill takes that and uh, yeah and twelve tallet pallets of potato washed potatoes if you've got the farmer Andy um, washing system mod in you can load them and he's now added the uh, ROS transport cages right what I found with these is there's a little glitch in the auto load unloading because if I press unload half of them go into the floor and the others jiggle about so you just load the product back up so press B and then all you do there is on your chosen side to unload you go down and you press M back right trailer then you go to your trailer press unload product and there you go you have to unload these with a forklift or telehandler or whatever so there you go there's a quick mod review on the auto loading DPW 180 and the 150s this is FS Panda Mushroom thank you for watching take care